situations will arise in our lives, but you gotta be smart about it. So so I'm at the airport. As you can tell by the title, we are going on another trip, right? And it's just me by myself today. However, I am meeting someone very dear out in New York. I'm really excited. This was like a super last minute thing. Like literally, I had like three days to prepare, get outfits together. Cause you guys know I'm about my outfits. Like if I'm gonna go and do a really good job, looks are all a part of it. So I'm going to New York with Disney um, UK for the premiere of the movie West Side Story. It's the brand new like remake of West Side Story. I'm a huge musical fan. So this is really exciting. I'm gonna be doing the red carpet. I'm gonna be doing press junkets. This is like the first time I'm doing anything remotely connected to like a movie or like proper press stuff and I'm freaking nervous. I'm so nervous but I'm so excited. Like this is one of the things that I had written down in like my goals like that I wanted to achieve. Perhaps last year, just before the pandemic, so 2020, for the fact that this is like the first one I'm doing and it's so massive it's like it's a huge freaking movie it's a Steven Spielberg film ah, I'm literally gonna fall over and cry <laughs> I'm so excited last time I was in New York was what 2019 David's birthday so I'm excited to go back although it's gonna be a flying trip but you're gonna be like in and out I'm gonna be there for perhaps like all of three four days and yeah I'm gonna take you guys along with me I'm so excited I can't stop saying I'm so excited. My flight is in about like 30 odd minutes or so. Oh, in about like 45 minutes. You know when you're really excited and you get to the airport like barely <laughs> and then there's nothing to do so you're like wondering. I literally went up and down, up and down like the the the, 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 the departure because there's nothing to do and then when I was like, oh, let me just go to the lounge. I say if you're a frequent flyer, definitely pays off to fly with one airline. Like even if the airline tends to be a more premium price, like in the long run, when you accumulate points and stuff like that, it's actually really beneficial. So with BA, I've accumulated so many points. So I have access to the lounge. Even if I'm on economy ticket, I still have access to like all the lounges. I get double bags and anybody that's on my booking gets that same privilege. So like it just pays off to like be loyal to one airline. Even if you don't use the airline often, just like sign up as a club member or executive member or whatever kind of membership that airline has and just reap the benefits, like stack up the points, reap the benefits. A lot of the time the points don't expire for like two years or so, so you have time to keep accumulating the points before they expire. I didn't sleep last night. We went from shooting content all yesterday, then I went home, I changed my wig, unpacked my suitcase from the shoot that we did, packed the suitcase for this trip. I didn't sleep. I got in the taxi and I slept <laughs> that was the moment I slept off like in the taxi and you know, I was mad like it, it was crazy I think I only woke up like one time on the journey and then literally when we were arriving I was up again but I'm shattered I'm running on empty running I'm run I'm sprinting on zero right now so that flight I'm gonna sleep the whole way through With the guys, I They didn't let you check in? No. So I had a feeling. There was so much traffic. Checking in, please. Okay, let's go. Hey, room! <laughs> I feel like the upgrade isn't a bad idea. Where's the window? <laughs> oh, sorry. I mean, is it dark? Where's the light? Is it dark? Is it dark from outside? I don't know. You came up from outside just now. It wasn't that dark. That's for sure. Is it dark? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> 
What happened? I feel like it's all the buildings, you know. The is living the quarters. Living is this the living room? Yeah. One door. Well, he said there's two doors. Oh my god. <laughs> this is stressful. <laughs> okay, this is the double door. Okay. All right. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. This is the bed bedroom. Oh my god, this is the bedroom. And this is the living room. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, the full living room. <laughs> I'm gonna need that. Oh, he's calling. This is nice. Hello. We're ready. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Forbes recommends an extra five to ten if you have an unusually large amount of luggage. Okay, what we do? Why is that money so long, guys? <laughs> right? Why is that money so long? Okay, no, we need to find out what we're doing because it being it being is doing me. I need to charge my phone. West side. Get it? I like it. Watch it. What the film? Yeah. No, David. I have had no time to do anything. Thank you. The lounge area. <laughs> That's the dining area. This is the bar area. What other area? We got a coffee machine. Oh my god, this coffee machine looks like a barista machine. Oh, it's entirely too much. I need to I need to my finger away. Oh my god, and look at the look at the coffee thing. Why is it so it looks like a shot glass? Is that a cup of coffee? Yeah. yeah. That is entirely too big, I can't lie. Oh, I think it's pissed it. My bad. So where are we gonna where about to eat at? I wanted to find somewhere to eat. Where about I'll leave that to you, you know. Where are we about to eat at? What what are you feeling like? I'm feeling like New York food. I feel like I look swollen as well. Heading out to get something to eat. We actually just came from outside, but we just went to, there's no Target near here. Mm, it's quite far. Ah, it's like them blocks. See, that's where we nap in, is it? What? The Target. Target. I guess it's the one that's still open. Let me get down. We're not going to Chinatown, are we? Mm, no, we're going to Soho, which is close. Oh, I'll see if it's on there. If you guys can hear me, but they asked for um, vaccination proof before you can sit inside and eat. You can sit outside and eat, but sit inside, they need proof of vaccination. Which is mad different. They do that in Italy though, right? Yeah. They don't do that in the UK. <laughs> do you want to eat? Come on in. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Very dangerous. Looks great. Did my battery die at the restaurant yesterday? It's terrible. I'm so sorry. As predicted, we have been awake for a while. I've been trying to do this stuff that I need to send over. But the plan for the day is breakfast. Breakfast! <laughs> the plan for the day is breakfast. Why are you laughing? Breakfast. Breakfast. And third, I'm going to get ready for this thing that we got today. The premiere is tonight. Tonight is the premiere. The premiere. This is literally here. What's it called? Persian Square. This is the menu. Yeah. Look good. It's great. Looks great. Oh, she's gonna show it all. She's one thing you know how to 
do is rock that LBD. And I know you're gonna be sick of it. I'm the girls are gonna be gagging, crying. Oh, it got so dirty! Oh, I'm ready. I'm oh, no, you don't try it. I'm like, what? I'm like, what? I said, have you tried it? Well, you don't try it. I haven't, you know. That's another worry. And I'm gonna have to take my leg in because take my thighs in the dress. Because, you know. Oh, and I've got this. I've got this from Kai for the dinner. So when are you gonna wear it? Hmm? When are you gonna wear it? The dinner. But when are you gonna wear it? That's my question. Because I have a dinner look too, and I'm like. When are we gonna swap looks? <laughs> right. So this is for the dancing class. My joggers for the dance class. These are all my thermals. We're heading out. We just left going for breakfast. So I put my hands up and play my song. The last time away. Not in my hand like. Yeah, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Shaking my ass. Shaking there my is ass. no ass. Shaking. Not in my head. Not in my head like yeah. Moving my hips. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's not always about shaking your ass. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm in New York. I have a New York state of mind right now. No one usually knows that part. That's why I made it an effort made an effort to learn it. Oksono in Ankuchahana, and I love you more than my life. And I hit Pakiaka baby, Pakupenda Mim Sana, Mojeta da Hashakuda. I really don't like buildings that are like dark on the inside because you don't know. Because you just don't know what's the time of the day outside. We are going to 42nd Street. Where are we going? Somewhere around the corner. Left, right. It looks amazing. This is what we want. This is what we're looking for. This, this is it. You always wearing them glasses. You don't want to let no sucker look you in your eyes, huh? You better show them eyelashes. You love what you do with a patch. Ooh, that shit attract. All he want to do is gas me. How we end up in the backseat. To the bag, we on the same page, you the same way. Look, look at what he said, Arthur. Oh, oh, like it, it, listen, look. Stop, stop shouting. Look, look, look. I know what it looks like. Man. No, I can't wait to see my name in life. No one's gonna stop me, you see. What's your name? Tiny. We're gonna try and get a picture of David, but we need. It's gone, 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 gone. Take a link, take a link. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Stay there. That's right. Oh, why is my phone being slow? Stay there. Yeah, go on, go on now, go on now. Yep. Don't throw it. <laughs> Can you be serious? To the left a bit. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, pose, pose, come on. Yeah, it's nice. 13 seconds. Yeah, that's nice. Go back and do that again. You guys, oh. it's snowing. It stopped. No, it's still going. Girl, it stopped. It's still going. Before it was more fun. I'm just saying to David that I feel like I'm overdressed. No, you're not. You're perfect. Great. Better. On the block. On the block. On this block. And also at the premiere. Yeah. I feel like I'm just gonna take the tape off. So I've had to tape myself into this yeah, dress. Yeah, take it off because you can see it. I'm just gonna take the tape off because it's like you can, it keeps coming off and you can see it. Oh, I think the taxi's there. Okay, bye, see you okay. later. Mwah. All right, let's go. Let's go to the movies. Let's go see the stars. Let's go to get in the taxi. To the bag. Be on the same page, you the same way Only keep the fam around me So let Thank me you. know what it's gon' be I don't plan on getting on school This is the last time or the first name? First name 
Okay. Have to do some COVID tests before we can get onto like the press line. These are like rapid ones, so the results are. Oh, the results get back in 10 minutes is what we need I mean I can tell you guys in less than 10 minutes I'm not <laughs> I'm not positive <laughs> yeah go for it it's fine I'm used to it it's not are you sure that's even in there the one that they did, the one that they do in the UK, I can feel it in my brain. Yeah, trust me, I heard a lot of people coming on them. Oh yeah, there we go. Blood on it. Oh my God, really? Yeah, because they went too far. Hey. No, that's makeup. <laughs> Don't worry, it's just makeup. At least you help clean. I got five to clean. No, don't worry about that. Oh my God, we're here. Ah, this is crazy. No, I'm not nervous. This is insane. Wait, you'll be where Disney UK is. Oh, okay. Um, so this is my spot. Could we get some pictures of Esther, please? Is that right? Yeah. That'd be all right. Thank you. All right, so we're all in. We've done the COVID tests and everything. I've taken some photos of the press. I can't get it apart. Guys, my chest is going. Do, 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 do. It's not very good right now. Um, I'm so nervous. I'm gonna get a tip sheet so I know who I'm speaking to. I need to do some stories and stuff. Yes, I will need that, please. Thank you. And I think that's kind of it for now. I might wear my trainers until it's time to get started. Thank you. Yep. Right, amazing. Pulling up, babe, moving too fast. Candy paint with the windows all black. Seats, crème brûlée. That's what they gon' say. With the top down, screaming money, anything. We we'll up till six in the morning. When the sunrise will be on it. Well, I Definitely dancing on the streets of New York City yeah. without having a taxi like about to hit me, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's a magical night for yeah. everybody. Yeah. The movie is so beautiful. Yeah. The message in the movie, it's incredible. The cast, yeah. the talent, yeah. the love that we all put together like to make this happen is just brilliant. So I can't wait for you to see yeah. an, ex an experience. Thank you so much. Have a lovely night Thank and congratulations you. again. The red carpet's done. My match is like on low. Cause we going dumb We on the same way We the same way You know I be down to fist with you Where we going baby What's the move We should take a trip up to the moon Heading out for some food because we's hungry. We actually haven't eaten since breakfast. Um, so we need to get some in our bellies. Absolutely knackered. The film. Let's talk about the film. So good. Seriously. Oh my gosh. And you know what made it even better? I feel like was literally having the cast and production like in the room. So their energy was crazy, but no, it was it was in freaking sane. My battery died on my camera, so I managed to get some clips on my phone. We are going out to eat. We're gonna walk to the restaurant. It's about six blocks. We should be fine. You got the key, yeah? It's so cold, so I got the fur on. I was saying to David, I hope nobody comes and, and kicks me in my face because I'm wearing fur. 
Hey! Fancy seeing you here. You live in this block? David is absolutely shattered. <laughs> He's shattered. We go eat and we go sleep. I need to be ready by 12, so. Well, June 5, no luck. I probably will, though. No, you wouldn't. Why not? Because you haven't slept. David. We are walking to the discotheque. <laughs> to the discotheque. <laughs> To the discotheque. David, it doesn't have the energy for it tonight. I do actually. <laughs> you know when kids are fighting sleep, they be doing some shit and you're like, are you okay? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> he just wants I to sleep. I don't know. <laughs> Shut up. I don't know. We're about a block away from the restaurant. <laughs> Apparently it's open till two, but if, <laughs> if for any reason it's closed, we're just gonna Hi Taylor, right back into an Uber. Because <laughs> we have to st stand outside and wait for the Uber. Uber. Uh, we can maybe stand inside. You never know. So quiet in Manhattan. We are heading to a restaurant called Lagos, New York City. Hopefully the food's good. Actually, one of our friends sent us a message this morning saying that we should go there if we're looking for some food only issue and vibes. No <laughs> and then he said the only issue is there's no swallow. Her best. So should we? No, no, no. Mm. <laughs> I only put my one stars out. I'm on a mission, but we fall out. The city talking with a large mouth. Yeah, they at the boy like fall out. I'm gonna head home. Nelly one hit him. The food was surprising, I, I yeah. can't lie. Instagram be lying though, because that Instagram looks classy, but. <laughs> shut up. I mean, it doesn't, it's not bad. No, I didn't say it's bad. It's not like. But I had like different expectations. Mm, yeah interior wise yes. but I mean it's a vibe I can imagine like on weekends it's probably really popping but the food was good I can't lie that was good the drinks on point yeah, that's definitely somewhere that I could go and like just keep getting cocktails because the drinks were actually really tasty plantain <sighs> just how I like it juicy no hard <laughs> <laughs> it was like can it be I, both? It was actually quite juicy and I know what you mean. I know. It, it was like hard in the center, but it looked and almost at first bite it was quite like oh, juicy and soft. I really like that. No. Credit card. I don't know. Okay, I'm ready. Hi y'all. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life. I'm actually not that tired. Yesterday when we went to uh, Lagos, New York, as they call it, I was mad tired by the time we were leaving. When we got there, I was actually all right. But on the way back, I'm really feeling it, ain't I? I was like, I could really jump in bed right now. Got back, uh, jumped right into bed, guys. Right into bed. Yesterday was incredible. Like, it was actually so amazing. And you know, like I said yesterday, what made it even more surreal was the fact that Everyone there was so excited to finally watch the film. They wrapped production two years ago. I think Disney were battling like internally whether or not they were going to release this on Disney Plus or whether they were just going to wait for it to come out script big screen. And it was a very, very good decision that they waited because I can imagine. It's all the things that kind of go on behind the scenes that we don't particularly see when it comes to movies. They must have been battling so much with like how they wanted to do it because when you spend so much money on such a production you want to obviously like give it the best chance to make the revenue back that obviously is the business side of things but um just obviously everyone's hard work movies in general are best enjoyed on the big screen anyway and films like steven spielberg movies there's absolutely no way you want to skip the big screen experience so i'm very very glad that they kind of waited it out and they persevered through the pandemic as we all have done we have all done some persevering over the past year and a half, two years. Because some of us have been going through some shit before the pandemic. And then the pandemic came 
and put like icing on the cake like and just being in that atmosphere like i've never done press stuff before i've never done anything like that yesterday i don't think i've ever done a red carpet event like for something so official Thank you. So, uh, just want to confirm the information I have for you first, and then we'll go over kind of the ins and outs and the mechanics of everything. Sure. Uh, and if you have any questions, we'll be make sure that you're, you know, comfortable with what's going on. Okay. okay. Uh, I have you a so stare with uh, 20th Century uh, in the UK, yeah. uh, scheduled for a five-minute interview with Brian Darcy James. Uh, the email I have here is alex.gutman at disney.com. So, obviously, that's yeah. Alex with us. Um, the way this works is we will either email you or chat you the link for the interview room. Um, which would you prefer? I think we can um, chat, right? Well, we can, hi, I'm from Disney. Um, I'm a DJ. Hi. So you should have had my contact details from Esther. Um, and so um, it's Esther rather yeah. than Esther. Oh, no. Esther? Yeah. Esther, yeah. That's the pronunciation, but the spelling is correct? Yes. Okay, I am, yes, I'm making a note here just on the phonetics, like mm -hmm. this, the, the, the phonetics of it so it will be Esther and thank you for correcting me that's why we do this you kind of the breakdown of how the mechanics will work and okay. then we'll go over a bunch of settings uh, just to confirm it I'm so hot right now <laughs> <laughs> I might feel like I'm sweating welcome um, if you could just start with your name and outlet you may begin absolutely my name is Esther and I'm with 20th Century UK hi Brian how are you I'm good thanks yourself I'm okay, thank you. Congratulations on the release of the movie. How excited are you? It's been, what, two years since you guys wrapped? Two years and uh, about 12 hours since I saw it for the first time. So oh. I'm, I'm still intoxicated by it, honestly. I, I think this is a, an incredible, incredible movie and I'm so proud to be in it. Yeah, no, you should be. Um, but I wanted to ask you, what made you want to get involved in West Side Story? Well, I didn't have to think long or hard about joining the likes of Steven Spielberg and Tony Kushner, um, especially when it came to reinventing or reimagining something as glorious as the original West Side Story by Stephen Sondheim and Leonard Bernstein, Arthur Lawrence, Jerome Robbins, all these titans in, in the creative world. Um, you know, it, it, it's, there are things that are called no brainers. This was one of them. Absolutely, yeah, <laughs> definitely. And in your career, you've done both theatre and film, of course, but which one would you say is the most challenging when it comes to preparing and dedication and things like that? I think each one has its own challenges. So I don't, I don't know if one is more challenging than the other. Everything mm -hmm. is such a, uh, each, each uh, project is, is so uniquely different. Um, mm -hmm. The approach is always the same. The approach is always, you know, as an actor, just to try to explore and understand what it is that you're trying to create in terms of a character. And uh, you're, you're only given, you know, the car that you can drive by the writers that create that car in which you, you get. Not to, you know, it's a terrible metaphor, but, but in, in our case, we had, uh, you know, not to bang this metaphor even further, but, you know, we had this Maserati of a vehicle to get into. <laughs> that was just just perfect so um thanks to tony kushner's beautiful words and the the, the lens and the vision of steven spielberg so yeah. um yeah that 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 to me is uh is such a a blessing to be a part of that and what was the process of working on this film like and was it what was different from working on stage shows the sense of community that that was uh, evident from the very beginning. Um, the one thing that was actually interesting is that it was a bit of a hybrid because there's no way of creating West Side Story on, uh, for a film without having rehearsed it uh, right. as, as if you would for a stage version Absolutely. of it. So the time spent and the, 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 the communal nature of everyone collaborating in the ways that you usually do for a six week rehearsal for a Broadway play or musical, that I think really lent itself to uh, creating a sense of uh, cohesion and comradeship and and uh, like-mindedness. That I, I think you really uh, you really get that sense, you know, in terms of how these groups are are feeling together, whether they're jets or sharks, or uh, you know, or overall just as actors coming together, knowing the huge responsibility of carrying the ball at this <laughs> stage of the game in this iteration of this great classic. So. I think that is a, a huge aspect of the success of this film is the, the cohesion and the, and, and the, the spirit of, of everyone coming together 
which of course is the leadership that that where it starts is Stephen, and he made that very possible from just saying we're all doing this together we all want to do the best job we can and when you have someone as uh, as brilliant as him who's also as collegial and warm hearted it, it, there's really it's just a recipe for for success and I, and I think we've achieved that here yes I absolutely agree it's an amazing film thank you so much for chatting with me today it's my pleasure. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Have a lovely day. Bye bye. Away from you guys, always. <laughs> I don't know why she's running away. She's a mastermind behind all of this. But that was so quick, you guys. After like the second question, they had popped up. <laughs> they, okay, you go. You go that way. I'll go. I'll go this way. They had popped up, and they had, there was like a little chat that said two minutes left. I was like, two minutes left. Um, but that was great. That was really good. Uh, tick. Um, yes. Yeah, so we've got like forty-five minutes. Okay before the car is here to pick us up. Okay. For a fun day. Um, We're leaving in 45 minutes, David. Well, 40 minutes, 50, 30 minutes. Yeah. We are heading out. I feel like I look like a New Yorker. I feel like I, I could be, I feel like I fit. Whoa, oh. That's why I told you that she comes to the park. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi there. Welcome. Thank you. Going. Good, how are you? I love your shirt by the way. Thank you. That's a very awesome shirt. Thank you. Oh my god, we're still matching! Oh ah! Do you know we do this all the time? <laughs> Guys, look at look at the boots and look at his shirt. We do this so, all the time. Hi, I'm Gary. Yeah, kind of. Thank you. All right, so if you guys have any trouble hearing me, please say something, because sure. this is a tour for you, not for me. <laughs> All right, you know I've seen this stuff already. <laughs> so search on the remake and saw that there is a location involved up there. So there you go. But I don't know if they use the interior or just the exterior. Okay. Take pictures of but take pictures. <laughs> yeah. We're all set, man. Thank yeah, you. I noticed they speak with an accent. They're from Queens? Yeah, they're from Queens. Oh, yeah. Some disruptions, like right here, you got Park Avenue, which is 4th Avenue on the grid. The reason why they called it Park Avenue, I'll tell you in a bit, but it's um, truncated by Grand Central Terminal. There's a roadway that goes around it, but that's Park Avenue down there, and then Park Avenue's a tunnel. The tunnel was covered over. They had a center median all of a sudden. They decided to put, um, you know, flowers, grass, nature junk on top, oh, you know? Okay. And uh, someone came along and said, wow, 4th Avenue north of 56th Street looks like a park, looks great. So the name will stick and the real estate price is gonna go up. So this, the taxes are gonna go up because the city will pay for half that project. This was a company called the New York Central that built this thing and they paid for half of it. The city pays for half of it. The city of New York is not stupid. They've done stupid things, but they're not stupid. Like Together in the jump. 
was so good. <laughs> Finished dancing. But David just said to me that you know what we're gonna do when we get back to the hotel, right? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so you guys are with yeah. Lincoln? Yes. I feel like they love these revolving doors here. These people don't like to chill. Ubers be like, Ubers be Ubering and they be here right now. So we have to go. Ubers is she here? Ah, we're running. We're going for breakfast. And it's actually such a really lovely morning. It feels like a really good day. I feel like it's going to be a great day. So don't you think? Going home today. I don't like that. That's the part that I don't like. Yeah, see that. That was a move. Oh, David, I'm a mess. Oh, you really are. You're not supposed to agree. No, you really are. I don't know if I've got comments. Like, oh, I do. Oh, we did it. Thank you. You got the key. You're on key. Yeah, okay. Put braids in my hair this morning again because I feel like when I fly, I don't want anything like in my face, especially when I'm like trying to get cozy with the blanket. Morning. I'm hot. to my mum, I'm in Tajay. It's look how many layers I'm wearing. I've got a coat, I've got this, I've got a jumper, I've got a thermal, I've got my leggings, I've got thermal under the thermal, I've got socks. I don't play with the cold. Anyway, look, do you want any of these cereals? Hi Bob, would it be possible to get some help with our bags please? Why is it three dollars per bag to store your bag in the hotel you're staying in? <laughs> no, I'm trying to see. <laughs> it's David's care. I don't care, but I'm just, just counting. I just want to know how much. But why? Did I say no, do the cheap? That's crap. We're gonna do it anyway. <laughs> we don't really have a choice. Are we gonna be lugging around five pieces of luggage around New York City? I don't think so. gonna get our stuff and heading to the airport fortunately we're going to different airports we've left our bags that cost us $21 to store here absolutely ridiculous hi, hi. just want to collect our luggage please. yes please do you um do you have transportation i'll take it to the door for you gonna do an uber uber okay yes. uh, where is it oh okay bye bye are you allowed to do U-turns? No, I'm yeah. Okay, but you're gonna do it anyway. No, you could. Oh, you can make a U-turn? Uh-huh. Oh, okay. Hey guys, so I'm currently in the lounge. It's gonna be about, I think like another hour. Roughly about another hour. So it's definitely about. Oh, but what a great trip it's been. I just feel so grateful. Okay, so it was a very, very 
very seamless. <laughs> Just got in the taxi, guys, and I'm making my way home. I think this is where I'm gonna end the vlog. I think it was a very, very successful trip. What do you guys think? Hi right, guys, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you guys in my next vlog. Defo a pinch me moment in my career so far. Um, can't wait to do more of that. So fingers crossed I get more opportunities. But yeah, thanks so much for watching guys and I'll see you in my next one. I'm gonna take a nap, do some work. It's like back to reality, although I was still working so I didn't feel like I was, but back to more work because like I'm on the ground. Do you know what I mean? All right guys, bye. <laughs> Do you really got me in the mood? I chose to make a little me and my brothers like